Hi guys, in today's Blender 2.8 tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can change your main camera in Blender 2.8, allowing you to render your scene from different views. So here I've got three separate cameras and I'm going to make a render of this scene, very simple scene, and I want to render three images, one from each camera. The first one is easy enough, so this one is our active camera. If we hit zero on our number pad, we can see the view of this camera. So I can go to render and render this image. So now that I've rendered that image, I'm then going to go from slot one to slot two, ready for my second render. Now you might think, oh, it's just a case of selecting the camera and then let's preview it by pressing zero on the number pad. But no, it just takes us back to our main camera. So how do we make another camera the main camera that's going to be used for the render? Well, we can do so by either coming to view, then go to cameras and we can set the active object as camera or we can use the hotkey control numpad zero which on a Mac would be command numpad zero. So if I left click that it takes us straight into the view of that camera. So now I can just edit the position of this camera and I think it's a little bit too close. So what I can do is I can go to view, lock camera to view, hold down the control key on my keyboard and then hold down my middle mouse button and just zoom out just a bit maybe bring my camera down a little bit perfect so now i'm able to render from this camera so go render render image and i've been able to render from that camera because i changed the slot from slot one to slot two, I've been able to keep my original render from the other camera. So now let's do that with our third camera. So we're going to select our third camera. We're going to use the hotkey this time, which is control and then zero on the number pad. I've still got lock camera to view enabled. So this is going to allow me to easily edit the positioning of our new main camera. And now once again, I can just go render and render image. Oop, and there's where you've got to be very careful because I forgot something very important. I left it on slot one, which has now resulted in me overriding the original render that I made here. So what I'm going to do to correct this is I'm just going to go to slot three, then come out, and then it's going to be a case of selecting what was originally the main camera. And I'm just going to untick this box so I can make sure that it's the correct camera. Yes, it is. Then once again, one more time, control zero, Yep, that's the right camera. And now if we render this image, we get our third render. So if we look through the slots, slot one, slot two, and slot three. Three different renders, three different images from three different views. Thanks guys, and I'll see you in the next tutorial.